Hi guys, so I'm going to be here today, and I have a new series for you guys. Is Xbox One free to play games, and I'm going to be going over all of the free to play games on Xbox One, and reviewing them and playing them at the same time, sort of thing. So it'll be half each, really. And yeah, today we're playing Hawken, and I'm going to try getting a game of Siege. I have played this game before, and the servers aren't that great to finding a match anyway that isn't team deathmatch, so I'll see if I can try find a game. It takes so long to get a game. Right, so I've given up trying to get into a, uh, a game of Siege, so I'm going to miss out of salt, see how long that takes, and if it takes too long, I'll try find a game of team deathmatch. Joy. Took too long. I'm just gonna go into any mode. And see if I can at least find a server and I'll actually be able to play the game. Oh, we've actually found one. <coughs> Surprising. If you didn't know, this game is a bit like Titanfall. It has mechs. Like it's not called Titans, but they're mechs, and they're, they're called mechs on this game and. You can't run around like as a pilot or, or just the character. You have to stay inside of your your mech. And here it is. Uh, the game doesn't look too great. Like if you play on if you play on PC, this game probably looks a bit better. I'm playing on Xbox One at the moment. As you may already know. Oh, I actually got a kill. I'm surprised. Uh, yeah. So, I'm going to pair up here. You guys can judge the frame rate yourself because I have this running at 6 frames a second, 1080p on my Elgato. So, yeah, I don't think the frame rate is too good, to be honest. It can get a bit choppy at some times, but. Yeah, the, the graphics are okay in some places, but it's it's, it's not not the best. So I'm gonna see if I can try to get another kill. Yeah, you can jetpack up in this and like boost forwards and try to get over here. Yeah. All right. So the mech I have at the moment has this defense thingy, majiggy. So yes. It, it, do, it does help quite a lot, you know, if you have an assault mech, whatever, if you have them. Because I guess they can uh, inflict a lot of damage on you. Oh. Is that a kill for me? Nah. You can't repair though whilst in that, so... Yeah, you hold B to repair. Oh. Are these 10 minute matches? Because there's only been 17 kills in 10 minutes. And the game is like literally about to end. I haven't been in it for the whole game. Oh, what? I don't know. But yeah. Huh. Team Deathmatch isn't the best, like, game mode to be reviewing the game on, you know? There's not much happening in Team Deathmatch. Could you have that in every other game, really? Okay, we're on a different map here. Doesn't look too bad. Is someone in game chat? I'm not sure. Hmm. Okay, okay. Oh, we're in, we're in the lobby. Oh. Why did I have to wait that long? Alright, so each of the different ones have different strengths and that. I'm gonna I'm gonna choose the defense one again. Cause I think that one's quite good. So the maps aren't very colourful at all. And this map looks quite small. Don't see many places to go. Maybe you'll get a 
bit more action, a few more kills. Ah, that's cool. Or not. The enemies might be over here. <coughs> oh, oh god damn it. Right. The, the machine gun I have on here, it is slow at first and then it gets really quick. As you could tell. Alright. No, I just I had a voice breaker then. <laughs> Alright, okay. So, we are repairing up. Here. Alright, okay, okay, okay. Uh, do I go that way? Do I go? How many people are playing? Alright, yeah, I go that way. I go that way. Have I, have I still got my defense? Well, no, there's one over there. I don't understand. Oh my god. Literally, like, hardly any people playing. There's nothing happening. At all. The guy's listening to something. Really annoying me. Nah. I'm not sure if I should blame that on the game for the aiming or me. It's probably just me. To be honest. How do I get up there? How do I get up there? How do you even get up there? Is there a road or something? You can't even get up there, man. It's getting a bit blue. Uh, that's pretty useless. Actually. Ah. Alright. That's that's pretty cool actually. It's not that bad. Not that bad indeed. It's got a bit more more brown, more grey over it. Oh, for God's sake. There is not much happening at all right now. I am uh, I'm not that uh Oh, can I get two? Oh, I have rockets, don't I? Yeah. Alright, so, as you can see on my HUD inside of my mech, I'll, I'll just repair myself quickly. I'll, I'll show you. So, in my, in my, in my mech, uh, on the right side, there is missiles and health. You can get different ones for different mechs that have different abilities and that. I think you can, ch oh, you can choose. And, uh, yeah. And on the left is when I press A, it does my defense thingy. I'll just. Alright, so if I press Y, let's put down one of these balls or orb things. And if you die, it drops one of them. So, if a lot of people are dying, you can quickly get repaired. But, if you're safe and you don't think anyone's going to get you, you hold B and you can repair real quick but you can't do anything whilst you're repairing and it takes a little while to get out of the repairing animation so nothing at all is happening alright okay take that back something is happening right now so right trigger I have grenades and left trigger is my machine gun that may seem awkward it is a bit, I guess, but uh, yeah, left bumper is to use the forward boost thing, and right bumper is to like boost upwards, as in hover. And yeah, that's that's all like. And you have A to do the defense, and X to shoot, and your missile or whatever, and B to do health or Y even. Alright, we're going to choose this one. Now, I think this is an offensive one. Alright, so look, we have different stuff in on our HUD. We have less health. We might have more fuel, but do we have different guns? Oh yeah, we have different guns as well. Completely different. And I think it looks different as well. 
so that, that's cool. Yeah, it does more damage, definitely. Yeah, look. Oh, they have more people now. Do they have more than us? Oh, they do. Alright, anyway. Okay. So I said overheat in there, and if I press A, it has like a cooling thing. I'm not sure if that would cool me down or not. But we, we should go try that out. <coughs> Park a bit for cough, man. Alright. It isn't a grenade as such, so I can't arc it over. But, alright, if we go straight in here. Alright, okay, okay, okay. Uh, come on. No. I need to find out what them uh, X and Y do, because that might help me on the offensive side. Okay, so let's, let's try X. X is a it's a force sh field, but bubble, and Y is the grenade. Okay, we only have one of each. Does X refresh? No, no, no. All right, I have no clue where I am. Okay, the mini map isn't that helpful. It's quite small, but. It does show me where people are actually. Oh! Or could I just get a grenade kill on him? Ah! Throw down a. Uh, yeah, force field. Force bubble. Oh! Had me two and one there. This is a bit more. This is a bit, bit better than last game. You know, it's got a mo lot more people now. It's good, it's good. I'm gonna go with this one. I believe this isn't very good though but I'm still gonna choose it oh it seems a lot faster I said aerial assault was its its main thing so you can't sprint when you press down on the left stick it does the, yeah it does the enemy side thing All right, okay 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 I think I saw someone over here come on it's the end of the game <laughs> Come on, no! Alright, that game wasn't that bad. That, that was decent. I would try getting to a missile assault or siege game, but I, from what I've had in the past, I can't get anything. Alright, I'm on, alright, so left on the D-pad does the, does the thing, you can get different ones of them, and then right does a taunt. I'm going to leave this match and show you what else there is to have on Hawken. Okay, so we're going to go, go into the leaderboard first. I guess this is a global leaderboard. Yeah. Alright, that, that's, that's, that's boring. Daily rewards. Alright. I get, oh yeah, you can use these credit things. Like the blue, the blue ones, to buy mechs and guns and stuff, and I think the red ones for like skins and camos. But okay, let's go. Let's go on mechs. This is this good stuff. So, hold on, I'm, I'm messing about here. Zoom out. God damn it! All right, so this is the mech web, uh, and this has all of the different mechs on as you can see and then if I zoom in here we can pan across this that's ah, okay alright yeah so it tells you the strengths info and what it is what's good at no what type it is its ability and its weapons and then if I show you, you the the grid, it's just the same as the web, it just has all of the mix in a grid. It's not like such as a tree or not, but yeah, alright, so that's over and done with. Market, so consumables. 
Oh, I guess this. Oh, yeah, yeah. So the hollow emotes are just the the thingies that I was telling you about, and I'll get to them in a second. But you need you need like these. You need token things to use them, and every time you use one, it gets rid of one. Emblems is simple. Up in the top right, where it has my credits, my XP my name, and my my emblem. Say for example, I could change it, and it changes. And yeah, I'm gonna keep this one. And then, oh, that goes to stop. Microtransactions. Right. Um, career. What is this? I wanna. I want to customize my mech. How do I do that? I can do that. How do I do that? Select. Ah, okay, okay, okay. So, to customize your mech, you need to go onto the, the tree or web and click on the one that you want, and then you're in here. Okay, so, 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 so. <coughs> this it isn't popping up with anything. Weapons simple you can upgrade and has all the stats for all of them I'm not sure oh yeah okay oh yeah, yeah so dps damage per second i guess it's more on something going on there but then yeah and you could just buy different ones and uh, i get I, you have to pay for the orange ones so like the credit things. All right, so this is, I guess, speed, health, and just stuff like that. Basically, it's just a bit more complex. Items. I think this is what. I, no, I oh, know. No, no, no. Oh yeah. See, this is the rocket that you, I pressed X for, and then. Oh, okay. So it says tech group next to the thing. I guess different type of mechs are in a different tech group and that so the you can only use some for each different type of mech. Uh did I just go on yeah, okay, consumables. Um I don't I don't know what that is. Um, for co-op play, I don't know. Co-op bot destruction. Okay, I d I'm not sure what that is. Okay, cosmetics. Now this, this is this is the good stuff here. This is you could change the color, add stuff. All right, okay. This this one's this one's already unlocked. It's good. I guess all these do they don't really change your game much but this is if you buy like this is just a currency and that it just changes and then oh where do I alright if we go back to them and change the colour how do I change the <gasps> oh yeah you buy different ones thrusters probably look pretty cool but only if you can actually see them. I can actually see that. Very customizable. Like, and I guess that's how they want to make extra money on the game and that. Just use it. Right, so this, yeah, this is the taunts. This is, I think, it's the default one for this mech at least. And then you got all the different ones. A tea bag. Dog thing. Yeah, yeah. Um, and then you have the different things. This is what you can use at the end. You can use these in game as well. I think they may have added some more ones. I didn't see these emojis here before. But. Yeah. These are just this. I can choose any of these because these are all unlocked. So, 
yeah you can customize your HUD as well so on here you you don't have to have the actual bought currency in this you can use the t like credits you earned uh, yeah it just looks different like that and this one looks different like that as well doesn't really help you much well it could it could help you it could, that's why you can buy them with the credits that you earn I think I, yeah I, I bought I bought this one and it okay I'm gonna put the, I'm gonna put that on apply to all mix yes yes yeah it's cockpit okay decoration it's, it's pretty cool I once again this doesn't really help you that's why you actually have to pay for it so, so let's make it look real cool in here alright that's good that's good that's good 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 and then you could obviously buy that and all that it just adds oh, that's pretty cool it just adds it doesn't help you at all really uh... yeah right so this is your call sign and that and all this all that stuff your levels kd ratios all your different achievements in game ones anyway and that um there is training and i'm guessing this is private match or just explore the maps there's a de there's a decent amount of maps. I haven't played all of these because the servers aren't the best and you can't always find a game and all that. But then the training is pretty good for learning how to play and that is it I did play them myself. So yeah. Alright, so that will conclude my video today. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you did, hit like button. If you didn't, dislike and subscribe so we can hit 100 subscribers and put your notifications on so you can get notified when I next upload the free to play Xbox One game in the series so hopefully you enjoyed and I will see you in the next video